just do electronics. It's all about electronics. In this project, I just explained these how to measuring this gas cylinder gas level. And suppose in your home the gas is the leakage, then MQ135 sensor measuring the gas and the alert message given to this particular mobile number. I will just show this the see in LCD display this gas level normal and the level is the 28%. When you cross this 80%, then red light indicate your gas will be leakage and the GSM sending the text message to this mobile. Let me just show you. See, I just put my hand, put the hand sanitizer to the MQ135 sensor. See, is the S cross across this 80% and red light indicate and the other LCD also display this gas is the leakage. And then GSM sending the text message to this mobile number. See, the SMS will become his display this Hi Pratik, gas detected. Please open window and check your gas cylinder. Okay, we'll just show this component which component I use in this project. First, I use this Arduino Nano microcontroller board. Second, I use this 6.2 LCD display with I2C model. Third, I use this SIM 800L model. Fourth, I use this LM2596 step down converter to providing this 3.7 volt to the SIM 800. LGSM module and fifth I use this MQ135 gas sensor sixth I use six I use this red LED seventh I use this green LED I use this uh, zero PCV I put all this component and I do this soldering with the help of the zero PCV Okay, I will just explain this circuit diagram. In this circuit diagram, I use this 622 LCD display, Arduino Nano microcontroller, MQ135 temperature, I mean this gas sensor, and one red LED and one green LED. And I use this SIM 800 LGSM module. And I just use this step down converter to provide this proper voltage to SIM 800 LGSM module. Okay, I will just explain this project where I connected to this all this, I mean, this component to this Arduino Nano. First, the 602 LC display is I just connected to this I2C model. Okay, and then I2C model is connected to this. HD pin connected to this A4 pin number to Arduino and SCL pin connected to this A5 pin number to Arduino and the ground is the connected to the ground and the VCC is connected to this 5 volt of this Arduino. Uh, here I use this 12 volt 2 ampere power supply as I just given this power supply directly to this B in pin number Arduino and this R uh, ground connected to the directly ground okay and this 12 volt 2 ampere power supply going on this uh, I mean this uh, LM2596 step down converter also uh, input side I just given this 12 volt 2 ampere power supply and the output side is the operated only 3.7 volt proper DC voltage okay and the MQ135 sensor I use and this is the analog sensor and the digital sensor also First, the VCC connected to this VCC connected to the ground pin number, and here I connected this D out pin number to this A8 pin, sorry, A0 pin, and this I use these two LEDs. First one, red one is the directly connected to this D4 pin number, and the green LED directly connected to the D5 pin number. This is the digital pin number, and the A0 to A7 is the analog pin number. Okay, I just explained this uh, why I use this LM2596 step down converter. Uh, just like given this input side is the 12 volt 2 ampere power supply, and the GC, GSM SIM 800L model required this only 3.7 volt. That's why I use this output size is the 3.7 volt with the help of this potentiometer. Okay. And uh, this GSM TX and RX pin connected to this pin number D2 and D3. Oh, here I mistake I think is I am doing uh, this A0 pin number connected to this D out and this red one is the connected to the VCC. I will correct it in my circuit diagram. Okay, then I upload it in my website. The if you want to the circuit diagram, then please visit my website. I providing you correct I mean this uh, correct uh, circuit diagram in my website. I think you understand all the things and see this code of this project.
uh, here I define this uh, L, uh, I2C library because I use this 6.2 LC display with I2C model and here I just define this I2C address and I just connect it to the GSM module pin number 2 and 3 and uh, the gas sensor will be connected to this pin number A0 because the gas sensor is the analog sensor that's why I just uh, connected to this A0 pin number and the red LED connected to the pin number 6 and the green LED connected to the pin number 7 okay let's go and see this wide set of functions uh, in the wide set of function I just uh, define the random seized analog 0 because these I just want to this analog value of the sensor okay and uh, here I just define this uh, I mean this uh, LCD LCD initialize it okay and I just define this input and output sensors uh, the gas sensor is the input sensor that's why I just define this input pin and the red and the green LED is the output sensor and if you want to this customize this LCD just to type I mean this uh, I'll just define this LCD welcome to the just to electronics and I uh, in the three second I will clear the LCD and I just display again this gas leakage detected alarm okay uh, let's go and see this wide set of functions uh, just uh, I just yeah, I mean this I just create this data equal to analog uh, read value uh, in this serial monitor I just find out this uh, mm -hmm. uh, analog value of the sensor and the LCD will define this uh, gas uh, I mean this LCD also display this uh, gas scan is on and this uh, another cursor is will gas level and this display this data what is the value of this uh, sensor in this analog value okay uh, the main function is the if data uh, greater than 80 then JSON sending this text message and the LCD display this gas leakage and this uh, uh, red and green LED I mean this red LED high and the green LED low okay and suppose if you uh, I mean this gas is not detecting any gas and it's less than this 80 percent then uh gas uh, i mean this lcd display this uh, gas level normal and this red led low and the green led high okay here is the uh, i mean this sms uh, uh, how i send this sms to this particular mobile number i just defining this uh, serial print l i am uh, in send and here is this uh, mobile number if you want to this sending this text message to the another particular mobile number you just uh, change this uh, your country code and your mobile number okay the plus nine one is the country code and the 10 digit mobile number you change here and if you want to this customize this text you just uh, type this your text here also i uh, just type with the gas i pratik gas detected please open window and check your uh, standard okay this is the complete uh, explanation of this uh, code i just go to the tools and check all this board i am using this arduino nano that's so i just select this arduino uh, nano board and the old bootloader and I try to just compile it. See, in the right hand side is the compiling process and the compile done. I mean, this code is the 100% working. Uh, okay, let's go and upload this code. Then we will see this working. Of this I use this project. This is the total hardware of this project. And I use this Arduino Nano microcontroller SIM 800L. And I use this LM2596 uh, step down converter and two LEDs. First one is the red, second one is the green, and I use this uh, DC female socket and sensor. I use this MQ135 sensor to measuring this gas level, and I use this section to two display with I2C model. This is the front side view of the zero PCB, and this is the back side. I do so many connections. I mean, this back side view of this PCB. Okay. Yeah, this is the total hardware of this project. Okay, I will just explain this project how this project is work. Okay, this is the gas detecting system. See in the section row two LC display this gas level normal and the green light indicate your gas will not leakage. Okay, and this last column is so that the gas level is the 30 30 percent. I mean this this sensor value is not a gas level value, is not any gas leakage. Okay, and I use this MQ135 sensor to measuring the gas. See this sensor. I use this MQ135 sensor. Okay, and suppose if the gas is the leakage, then gas sensor is the detected in the X, and then GSM sending the text message to this mobile. I will just demonstrate of this project. This uh, small bit hand sanitizer in my hand, and I rub it, and then I put this my hand to this near of this MQ135 sensor. See the gas level is the 163 percent, and the gas scanning is the 
see the alert is the given the red light indicate and then lcd is the also display this cash leakage i put this 80 i mean this 80 percent suppose if the cross this 80 percent then gsm sending the text message say the sms will become is this display this i um, mean this sms will be said at hi pratik cash redacted please open window and check your cash cylinder okay this is the gas leakage system i hope you understand all this project okay i just saw this real time how to gas leakage detected and the gsm sending the text message to this uh, mobile number okay see this is the gas to love and i use this mq135 sensor and this is the total i mean this is the hardware of this model okay and here i put my mobile okay what i do i just open this gas and then mq135 gas sensor detected the gas and then gsm sending the text message let's do and try it is the so that this real time or not i just open my gas see the gas level is the increases is the 124 gas level and this alert i mean this alert led is the also alert see red led alert and then display is the sms send see gas leakage sms send and wait for the sms sms will come or not see the sms will become oh my god is the two sms will become is the hypothetical gas detected please open the window and check your gas okay then i just might open my window and i check my gas cylinders see the i do all the things okay this is the real time also working of this project okay i think you get all these things and if you like this video please hit the like button share with your all the friends if you new in my youtube channel please subscribe my youtube channel please hit the bell icon to get notification first thank you for watching have a nice day